Greetings, fellow mortals. It's like uh, calculate ingenious gaming, except we're not really gaming. Although I guess making music is a bit of a video game itself. We are making music today. This is LMMS, my DAW workstation, digital audio workstation. I haven't made music in over like a year and a half at this point, and I don't know how to make music anymore. And I think, oh, that, oh my god, my burp. <coughs> I figure that the stress of streaming the music I'm making is going to make me make awesome music. However that philosophy goes. So we're going to make some music, and we're going to start with Hat Basic, Kick Basic, and Snare Basic. I love that snare. Our tempo is going to be 128. We're going to make house. I'll save our file. Wait, no. House in the middle of our street. Our house. Anyways. We're trying to make house music. How do we make house music? I have no freaking idea. Anyways, we're going to use Synth 1 to help us out here today. It's a VST plugin for, I mean, all DAWs that support VSTs. I think this is VST2, though. Yeah, this is a beta from 2014. <laughs> it's a pretty old synth, but it's, it's actually shockingly capable. Like, check out this. It's ethereal. I should probably plug in my MIDI keyboard. Oh, yeah, I have a MIDI keyboard. Look at this. I got this thing for, let's see... $8 at a Goodwill a couple years ago. Or, I mean, no, not a couple years ago, like exactly a year ago. <coughs> and all I had to do was buy $40 worth of soldering equipment to fix it because the USB jack on the back was flaking on and off. Which is probably why it was so cheap and donated to a Goodwill out of nowhere. Let's plug it in to the, our front panel I.O. The front panel I.O. is the best I.O. And my external hard drive is hanging by a thread. I should probably fix that. Granted, this Toshiba unit has been peeing me off because it started clicking. It's four terabytes in size. I don't have four terabytes of information on there, not even close. But the thing is that I'm, I kind of need it because look at this. My main like two terabyte backup drive is kind of uh, looking a little bit, look, look a little bit bloated, and I should probably really just get a NAS at this point. Yeah, they probably went looking at this like, why don't you just use this? And I'm just like, here's the deal. Wait, do I have crystal disk info? Yeah, let's see. This is drive was drive W drive W. This drive has thirty five thousand six hundred and forty six hours on it, and I think it was manufactured in like twenty thirteen. This drive is ten years old, literally. I found it on an old in an old DVD DVR, and I mean it's as good a temperature. The health is good, but. I'm only really storing like really huge ass files like these uh these freaking like ProRes videos and the RAW that comes off of the Canon EOS M. I realize I'm not even making music at this point, but I really don't care. This is for some more backups. Chris Bank One. This is for a bunch of like presets. I think I have most of these presets loaded in. Yeah, here's like the Chris Banks. Apparently Chris has like a boatload of presets, which is awesome. So many presets. Also, back up for my SD card. And also, here's the thing that most people don't know. Is that Neo Odd. Think about that word for a second. What does Neo mean? It means new. Or like, you know, future. And Odd refers to the prefix of audio, meaning sound. What does sound have in it? Volume. So this is new volume. <laughs> Nobody saw that coming. Or maybe someone did, I have no idea. Anyways, a weird thing about all of them is that you have to close the program and open the program again to get keyboard MIDI keyboards to attach. And also to get the program to recognize any new samples you load. Like, as far as the um, program is concerned, your computer is frozen in time. It's just, it just has like its opportunity to run. But yeah, we're going to MIDI keyboard. That is working fantastic. So what key are we working in? How about let's just do C for now? You know, like C, C major. 
Also, hello, question R. Just make something you like, find a, find a beat you like and do it. That's good. That's good advice. The only thing I do is your mom, though. Got him. I love this pad. In the start, there was no one around. It just kind of like, it sounds like the intro to like a trailer. It just takes so long to swell. <laughs> like, holy shoot. I don't even know how the hell people make these kinds of presets. It's like, god damn. I'm gonna find something plucky. Let's find something plucky. We're gonna make a melody first, then go to trance. I mean, not trance. Then go to beat. You know, like the drum. That's what I'm looking for. Tinkly arp. Oh, that's a cool progression right there. So we have our metronome. Let's record that. That was not the right progression at all. And the tempo's off. Why is the tempo off? Seriously, why is the tempo off? I have no idea. Anyways, thank you. Why must you say that? I don't even know what that was. <laughs> I probably said something absolutely cursed back there. I say so many cursed things every single day. And it's just kind of... It's normal behavior for me, anyways. <laughs> That's a cool-ass bass. Wait, let's see. Woo! <laughs> oh, that's kind of exciting. Let's see, do we make something with this? Maybe yeah, that's like a drop lead. We're trying to make the beginning of the song. I don't know, I kind of like these chord, like, leads that's just like, you know, come with a chord, you know, this is like, that's the C right there. But, it's just like, you can't really do much with that. Ship melody. That's kind of neat. Okay, okay, let's actually, like, get into this. Let's see, find a lead, find a lead, 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 where's a lead? Uh, Stadium Trance. Maybe, like, uh, chords. That can be our chord instrument. Bass sounded nicer when it was deep. Thanks. That doesn't sound so nice when it's deep. It kind of just sounds like random nonsense. Anyways. <coughs> no, 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 no. That's, 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 that's a little bit too harsh, actually. I just, ah, uh, I got okay. Lead. That's a lead. I mean, it's a bell, but it's a lead. Let's work with it. This note was completely off. Do something else. I don't like that either. See, this is what I'm thinking. Like, I don't know how the hell to make music anymore. I'm just like, I play random bullcrap, and it just sounds like what? What the heck? I think it's called. One one of the songs I did a song with the build up, then it dropped. And it was nice. It was a techno song. It was called Challenge Me. That's cool. I haven't made techno before. Maybe I make techno. What does techno sound like? I've heard of I've heard techno music before. I just don't know like what it sounds like. Okay. Dark. 
So this is what is this? Holy crap. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Yes, this. Maybe I like do minus two octave. This is too much reverb. Let's uh, let's turn down the release. Yeah, sustain. Ooh, let's work with that. I think I need a faster tempo though, like like 132. Let's do that. I suck at keeping time, by the way, so I just rely on quantization. Got a melody. That never sounds like I'm promoting my channel. Oh, it's okay. Uh, how do I get to your channel? I cannot figure that out. Oh, wrong key. Oh, shit, I forgot how. Anybody just look that up on YouTube? Let's see. God, I cannot find it. I do cannot remember. Let's search Fallout 2, the question R. Yeah, I meant to check out your channel earlier. But I was just like, I don't know how the hell to get to it. Fallout 2, Sergeant's Art Domain. These are all different channels. Hmm. Well, Fallout 2, it's, it's like a kind of, I don't know what that is. I've heard of it. I played Fallout 4 one time. No, no, Fallout New Vegas. That's what I played. How the heck? Wait. Go to channel. There's literally a button for it. I'm stupid. Go to playing sleep music. Oh, sweet. You actually make, like, music? That's awesome. doop a doop Cup of cup of tea. Plus, I have study. A little bit of German. I can't translate it because I don't know the German word. I think let's see what was it called. Challenge me. Oh, that melody. Build up is a bit weak, but we can always you can always fix that kind of thing. The thing is that I don't even have samples to work with. I'm literally just using synthesizers. Well, I have samples for the drums, obviously, because drum programming is a complete like no man's land for me. All right, I know, I know what I want the drum to sound like. It's kind of going to be like an amen break sort of thing. Except I can't use an amen break because I don't have an amen break. And I don't know how the hell a pitch bend in LMMS to make it the right tempo. And I do not feel like figuring that out, so we're not going to be doing it. Anyways, documents. 
Samples. All my samples just live here. I use the same ones every single time. Kind of sucks I should really have more samples. Probably have more since I had serum at one point. Serum was pretty cool. I made some of my, well, I'd say some of my best work with serum. Including one song. Where is it? No, it's not that one. And where is it? LMMS. Lomamus. Boop it up it up. Do 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 do. I don't know where the hell it is. This is just all my music. I was trying to make a song before this. I don't think it really turned out though. Yeah, this is it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Cool drop, but I never ended up finishing it. It's like I don't know what to do with it. I tried to make an intro, and the intro sounded completely different. It was supposed to be a remix of another song. I just came up with that lead melody in the middle of doing some random nonsense. Anyways. OTT makes everything better. That's what doctors say, apparently. I can make funk. 808 cowbell. <laughs> Wait, we're making EDM. I don't know, I guess. This is, I just have some of these somatics sample packs. So, yeah, now we have like, uh, this is 132. It's like I, I could use those, but I don't know how to pitch bend them and should it be one? Nah, we're programming our own drums. Beat baseline. This is gonna sound like garbage, by the way. Cause this is like the most basic drums possible. At land, I forgot one of the, the kicks. One of the hats, I mean. Yeah, we just need to find like more better drums. See kicks. What do you want? I'm thinking this one, even though we're not making future bass. I don't know. See if I want to. So, do we want to clap or? We want a snare. How hard is it to find a snare that actually sounds like a snare? Is this a snare? Let's see, there's snares, drums, snares. Wait a second. As far as one I saw a snare that was really similar, I don't know, maybe I'm just tripping. Uh, oh, these have like a lot of melodies. I don't know. I mean, I don't mind people who use melodies, obviously. Because like at the end of the day, you're adding your own content to it. It wouldn't sound the same if you weren't the one like actually mixing the song. And obviously adding lyrics on top of it. It doesn't come with lyrics. I love the pitch bend wheel. Anyways, do -do -do -do. using beat drum, we call it the work. That's what we got. 
I use apps because I use my phone. That's that's fine. Any page job make a sort of rhythm that goes right, left, middle, repeat. The repeat until it goes right to left, then middle. Oh, you mean like these? Okay. Oh wait, I'm missing a hi hat. Let's see. Yeah, I don't mind you making suggestions, by the way. That's actually perfectly fine. Because I don't know how to make music. It's been long since I've made music. And I have... I would play some of my old songs, but I have literally done nothing but play my old songs for so long now that it makes me depressed. Let's see. Let's see okay, we got four bars. There we go. All right, let's add a Reese. I think, I don't know if we, I have a Reese preset. Maybe I have one in triple oscillator we should have a triple oscillator it's like a that's like a synth for noobs but check out this first of all i gotta detach midi from this gotta attach midi to this it's a flute they never thought you could make a flute in 3x oscillator. Let's turn down the, uh, whatchamacallit a bit. flute. <laughs> Sounds creepy, thank you. <laughs> I love this flute preset. I love it. I love it. I love it. I think this is literally just like white noise, two sine waves, a little bit, uh, you know, detuned a bit. Is it too detuned? I know, they're all set to mix though. And just a boatload of reverb. <laughs> Seriously, without the reverb, it sounds like this. I don't know what these plugins are. They might have been what makes it sound less noisy, but I don't know what those are, so we're just going to ignore that. Don't think about it too much, you might go insane. Oh, and I made this. It sounds like if a fart and a trumpet had a baby. I made a trap beat out of it at one point. I don't know where that beat is. It's in one of my project files, though. It's all I know. Was it in... Cool Melody? Oh, this is a full song, by the way. This is the song I made in 2021. The only song I made in 2021 is like the end of like when I was just like feeling like making music Cause after the end of 2020 and I made, I don't know, I was, I was like, you know, I was going. Then I ended up making a bunch of whips, didn't like any of them. But then I finally made something I liked. I took a bunch of those whip ideas and just turned them into one seven and a half minute long song. Oh, this isn't it. This is like a really short section. What is this? Oh yeah, this song is also a remix of another song, and that flute has a ridiculously long reverb on it. This 
is literally just a saw with reverb on it. It sounds like strings. You can make an entire orchestra out of basic effects and sine waves and saw waves. Was it Cool Melody 2? Sorry, I'm just trying to find this because I want to see where the hell I stored that trap beat. If you're doing a creepy song, maybe I could do a creepy song. It would sound great if you're doing a Soviet song. The, s the sound you said, the trombone, and the fart had a baby. <laughs> oh, yeah, I could turn that into, like, one of those, like, uh... Like, what kind of Soviet song? Like, I think of, like, hard bass. Or, like... So da 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 I don't know the lyrics to it. This song is absolutely insane. And this saw uh, preset is one of my favorite because it's just such a nice super saw. But it sounds like it has a lot of reverb, but it actually doesn't, which means you can use it in like really plucky scenarios like this. Yeah, it's really cool. Uh, is this it? No, oh, I have to turn off looping. Oh, this is it. This is supposed to be part of the song originally, but it's just kind of at the end here. Oh my god. What a weird ass song this is. I mean, this entire thing. This song has over a hundred tracks. This is all over the place. Oh, okay, it's like the main kind of like melody. Let's see. Why is the tempo so high? This is supposed to be at 82 BPM. I used to make be able to make music like that. You're like, ah, that's an actual song. I mean, this is more like three songs put in one, and there's also an orchestra part in here. This is my own original melody. Wait, no, it's not. I don't know where that project is then, because... The hell? Did I delete the original melody I made? That sucks. Anyways, we, that's, we're trying to make a new song. Let us listen to old stuff. I literally told myself I wouldn't be listening to old stuff. It does sound nice. Thank you. <sighs> it's only because I put OTT on the master. Don't do that, by the way. That's a, that's a horrible way to mix your songs. Mix your songs. Mm. Ooh, maybe I use, like, like, it'd be like, no, wrong one. But like, if I connect, like, the MIDI to this, it would be kind of like, uh, you know, like, a kind of, like, hard bassy, like, But like it would be like kind of like a rapid fire kind of like it's like a hard bass kind of drop. I don't I've never made hard bass before, so I don't even know what the heck I'm doing. Let's just record this though. All right. We got, we got kick. Let's see. Let's see, what does this sound like? Oh, so you have to t increase it. Wow, 
Let me look this up. Instruments used in hard bass. St. Petersburg, Russia. Oh, literally is did it originate from Russia. That's great. Hell yeah. Music of Russia. That's what we have like a bunch of hard Russian hard bass. How to make hard bass. I don't know how to make hard bass. Slav dance hard bass. What exactly is hard bass? Hard bass dancing is insane. So, so that's literally the drum beat I was doing for like kind of like an amen break sound of thing. And it's literally just the other instrument is literally just like the freaking this, this. An instrument that kind of sounds like that, you know, like but that has like a frick ton of pitch bends on it. Ah, oh, it's so detailed. Hello, you have a dumb suggestion? I am using LMMS. Also, I said at the beginning of the stream what software I'm using. Also, it is good to see you. I'm going to develop my own 3D game. That is hella cool. One time I actually was making soundtracks for games. I was trying to score a game. Uh, well, but you joined the stream, you know, Habani. I think that's his name. I haven't talked to this guy in a long ass time. Is it in here? But I made that kind of like a boss battle sort of theme. Where is it? Boss battle. This is, it wasn't like finished or anything. And it's also not even that intense, but I just kind of liked how dark it sounded. Yeah, like that's kind of crazy. Oh my god. Don't do that anymore though. I haven't made me movie music. I haven't ever made movie music. That's bullshit. I've never actually been hired to make music. I've just been like, okay, I can make music. How about let's offer my services to somebody who might pay for them? I never got any money for that or anything like that. It was just kind of just like a big kind of thing at that point. Maybe I just like paste this onto the drums. Ah, wrong thing. Maybe just make a new beat bass line. All right. Uh, ultimate ways is. Wrong one. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh. That's way too low. Maybe I do like. You know what that sounds like? <laughs> Does anybody know what that sounds like? That sounds like this song. Everybody knows what this one I'm talking about, right? It literally sounds like that. Also, I gotta get rid of this. It's kind of funny. Uh, clear notes and... Unmute. Oh, that sounds way cooler. To cover Bad Apple, that would be funny. I know how to make music. I just don't know music. I also don't know music theory. Music theory? What's that? I've never heard of that. Maybe do like kind of like a build up. I get like a snare. 
Oh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna do like a build up, then we're just gonna fucking drop it. Drop the base, as we say. Just kinda like paste it. No, uh, that sounds like a decimator right now. You do not want that. Oh, no, wrong thing. <laughs> I've copied the wrong melody. This isn't even a melody, it's just literally a bunch of notes. It's more of a rhythm. You know, like if you've ever used a patchwork, let's see. Apple. So you gotta like kind of extend the notes because otherwise they're going to suck. Maybe I also kind of have to cut off the low end though, because that sounds like that's going to muddy up the mix. Let's see. Yeah, how about we just like duplicate this twice? Or just like, kind of just like... First of all, we have to make this more intense. Why are we panning? The frick? Just literally... Be like... Where you, you know how they have like a freaking rapid fire, like rocket cracker snares? Firecracker snares? Drop the bass like you drop grandma's off the stair. <laughs> oh my god. Also, I actually might, would not, might, might not be a bad idea to like make a cover of a song, but the thing is, most of my covers or remixes turn into original songs. Let's see, I'm gonna say, like I said, that one demo, I sh the first demo I showed, was originally supposed to be a remix of Moon Wisher, the song by one of my friends. He makes amazing music, which has stopped making music, which kind of sucks actually, because now we don't have amazing music anymore. Well, I do, but he deleted all the stuff off the of SoundCloud. Yeah, I think we just like kind of just like uh We just kind of like pitch up this things too. Oh, dude, I'm coming in with the heat of good ideas. That's not gonna work. I can't. It's so tedious working with this program, though. Let's see. What the heck? Why isn't it like, why, where is my melody going? sound quite as smooth as I was imagining. This is way longer than it needs to be. Let's see. One, two, three, four. 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 Maybe let's do like a drum fill over here. Okay, okay, okay. I kind of just like do like the. It kind of just goes down like this. <laughs> it might be a little bit too high pitched. And like it's just bass. Wait, I know exactly what we need. Let's see, let's see. I you're gonna not you're not gonna believe this. Instruments. Where is it? Where is it? 
Where's the base? Base. I, I'm looking for... Oh, I don't want to spoil it. I just don't want to spoil it. Base. <laughs> there it is! Base. What if I not ironically used that? It's like in the middle of the measure, just like... Base. base. Just base. Let's see how that sounds then. Oh wait, and this needs to be longer. That's what I was missing. Okay, okay. Well, that, and also I was missing like an actual. Let's see. <laughs> Can you see it now? I don't know if I have like a kind of like synth that goes with that though. And also we have to get rid of this. We're going to replace it with something way bassier. And also triple oscillator. Now's your time to shine because we're going to make a. We're going to put OTT on you and then we're going to EQ you because. Putting OTT on a sine wave is like. I don't know. What's that like? What's that like? I don't know. It's kind of like. Putting, you know, like, tall shoes on your feet to make yourself look taller, even though you're not. Anyways. EQ, let's cut out that clipping. We do not like clipping. It's like a sine wave, so. This is literally just going to be like, look here, are we in. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. We're in B, I guess. I never actually. <coughs> you don't hear of a lot of songs written in B, do you? Bass. If you use a bass, you were based. I'm very based. Everybody here knows that, especially Glubby. One time he opens the door to the classroom, nose falls off, and he fixes it almost immediately, even though he didn't know how to do it. That's song like the song with King Ju the song with King Julian. I'm not sure if I know that one. The one that's like, I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it. Oh, my webcam is dark again. This webcam sucks. I need to get a new one because it will not keep its settings. And it just sucks. Come on. Please? I think it's going to actually keep those settings even though everything is a blur now. Because of the high shutter speed, but whatever. We're going to have to deal with it. How the heck do you make like a really crazy just... Just like bass, 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 bass. Uh, I know we have like bass in my samples. Maybe to make a, a sample bass. I've never done that before. Let's see. Okay, let's see. One shots, eight oh eight. This is a D sharp. I don't know why these have to be like specific notes. Like why can't they all just be A? Like seriously, what's the point of having all these be different notes? Maybe actually this might work better. In this it's also an A. Which means I don't have to screw around to figure out what note's supposed to be. One, two. This is gonna be like a really like flat. I mean, obviously, you have to have like the little kind of like variations at the end, which is very generic. I am not trying to make a masterpiece right now. I am not gonna lie to you. Well, maybe I would lie to you, but I wouldn't lie to you specifically. Because that is very mean. Also, side chain. We need side chain, of course. I think this is going to be our side chain, so we are going to go into a kick. I still don't remember how to do this. You go to peak controller, turn off caps lock, go to peace controller. Turn the amount down, so like, 
basically how this works is that it detects the peaks in the sound. So like whenever you activate the kick, that creates like a peak, you know, it kind of goes like, if you imagine the waveform, it goes like, so like it detects that peak and then it's like, okay, everything attached to this that's being controlled by the peak controller is changed by this amount. And since we set it to a negative modulation amount, everything goes down. The volume goes down on everything else. So it creates a side chain, which we should know, which, which is all like all house use, mu music uses to get like that kind of punchy, you know, like in your face kind of sound, which is exactly what we want. Anyways, if it's all we need to do now is just attach this to, first of all, go to our channel, add another uh, mixer channel, connect that through to our controller. This is our first controller. It's the only controller in the song right now. And now let's see if we can uh, like demo this live. Uh, yeah, see, look, now you can see it's going down. And now we just need to attach everything that's not the kick to it. FX Master. So let's see. It still sounds kind of weird, though. Yeah, I don't know what to do with this. Okay. Maybe it kind of like goes to like a break, like a house breakdown later on. I don't know. Use a base if you were base. Just use my webcam for YouTube and model. And VTube, VTuber model. Oh yeah, you're a VTuber. I forgot. Imagine being a VTuber. I use a ancient 1.3 megapixel Logitech webcam with right light technology. And it has a maximum resolution of 640 by 480, as far as I know. Also, they, it looks like someone left. Thanks for joining in, though, Gwabi. I think that was you who left. <sighs> this is what we have so far. Get like a really like you know hard style not to be confused with soft style hyper hard style come on it's gotta be something that's kind of like a very intentionally hard bassy right let's see all presets first i don't think there's gonna be anything in here yeah this is all just like what is this i have to attach my midi keyboard to this again God damn it, we do not need any of this. Just attach or detach our keyboard from the thing, attach it to the other thing. All right. Well, this set might actually be useful. Oh, this sounds kind of fucking freaking weird right now. But if we push it up like an. Kind of like that, uh, I don't know if you guys have ever seen that one song. Uh, what am I thinking of? What am I thinking of? I'm thinking of an object. No, I'm not. Uh, music videos with sexy girls using tools. This is the one. Satisfaction. It's kind of like that, you know. But maybe we remove some notes just so that way it's kind of clearer, you know? Like presently, it sounds kind of like complete garbage because you can't, you can hardly hear it.
Maybe we just like kind of have only have like two notes. Let's take all the attack off of it. We don't want any attack. That's the thing of buying Logic Pro for another lol cow distract. <laughs> Distracts. Let's wait a little bit. Oh yeah. Also, oh, looks like we have three people who are watching. I think that's a record. Thank you for joining us. Looks like we're. Almost an hour into the stream, that is insane. <coughs> Just use Lomamus. VR chat series I'm doing. I don't ever really. Mm, you know, the thing is, the only VR headset I actually want it costs a thousand dollars. Not really willing to drop that much dough on a VR headset. I am, however, willing to drop that much dough on maybe a car. I don't know. It only costs a thousand dollars, and it's in a total ripoff. Definitely not a phone. I've never spent more than five hundred dollars on a phone, or four hundred eighty dollars on a phone. My more ex my most expensive phone is still my Pixel 6 Pro. Where is it? <coughs> this one. I don't use this daily anymore. I use the Red Hydrogen 1, but after I get a new battery, I'm going to be switching to my very dilapidated Motorola Z2 Force. That is a sad piece of technology, but I missed the Moto Moz, and once I super glue it back together, it'll be fine. I just use a new battery, because the battery literally is so dead that it does not recognize it anymore. All right, all right. Let's all right. What are we doing? We're trying to find a preset that sounds really like hella crazy. Oh, I know what's happening. It's like kind of like going. Oh, that sound makes, it's like kind of like staring at the color blue for like five minutes and then looking at like an orange wall, it, but it looks green. Like once you, once you hear that sound, it kind of just like becomes something else. Anyways, we're going to find an actual like kind of like lead synth kind of deal. What are we, what am I doing? I don't know. I remember in Vector was kind of cool. I don't know. I can't remember if this VSD still even works. What a weird synth. I don't know how the hell to use this, and there's no presets. Unless there are presets. Let's see. There are presets. Not bad, not bad. I can't remember where the hell I got this from. Maybe this? No, that's way too high pitch. <laughs> oh, wait, the hell. I right, this is off key now. He needs to be in. Where the hell is that stupid desk? There it is. It needs to be there. 
Because a crazy ass iPhone 14 Pro Max, the iPhone 14 Pro Max. Oh boy. Or oh girl, depending on what you prefer. <coughs> Oh yeah, I still have the iPhone 12 Pro Max, the $200 iPhone 12 Pro Max. This thing is, actually this is not that sad, it's kind of cracked, but like, the fuck, a new Mac has been added to iMessages. Are they talking about my MacBook? Okay, that is my MacBook, god damn, it's sending me a, a, a message because... Unknown to me, I accidentally formatted my compact flash card in OS X with my Blackmagic, well, not mine, but the school's Blackmagic Pocket 4K. So I couldn't open it with my uh, regular Windows computer. I had to boot up my t mid-2013 MacBook Pro and do it that way. <laughs> Alright, let's see how that sounds. First of all, side chain. Oh yeah. That sounds like garbage. Maybe, let's see. That sounds like such garbage. <sighs> Maybe I should just work on this other song I was working on earlier today. I made this today. I just don't know how to continue it. Yeah, multi-chorus the fuck? Why is it multi-chorus and reverb working? That's weird. That's weird. Okay, this is this is all weird. Let's listen. This is also supposed to be a remix of a song. Sinosure's Run. You don't know who Sinosure is. Good, because he stopped making music like two years ago. I made this back in 2018, by the way. This is one of my best songs from then. In this part, the like, this part over here is new. You ever wanna run away? I do sometimes Do you ever feel that way? Well, I do sometimes Break free from the chain That hold me to your ways If you saw me happy You would see the light of day this part sucks. I still need to like make a proper build up for this. It's like a breakdown right here. So yeah, maybe we continue that, that song, this song, one of the songs of all Half of that space is filled by this synth, by the way. I kind of love how it sounds. It's very trancey.
Also, thinking of changing out that with, like, the very classic kind of just, uh, you know, synth patch thing. Yeah, like this. Also, this needs to be moved down an octave, because that is way too high. <laughs> let's see, let's just do that instead of fixing it properly. Having there being kind of like a vocal in this empty spot, like, it's like, ah! something like that. I can't really sing, but I auto-tune can help me sing. <sighs> so how do we continue this? First of all, let's make those fills we were talking about. I don't know how to make a fill. How do we make a fill? Let's get our fill of fills. Phil Nye, the science guy. Isn't that his name? Oh, this clap is kind of cool. It's just kind of like, uh... It's like that, like, Opus 1 song. Have you ever heard that? Let's see. Opus... No... One. Yeah, this exactly. It's literally just delay. I kind of like it though. Anyways, drum fill. I wish I knew how to make that kind of like really dramatic like last chord which goes to the wrong key. It's like I don't know. Anyway, let's not to think think too much about that or else we'll go insane. Let's see drums. Use a drum kit. We need toms. No, that might not work out. I think I'm actually gonna know. Tick, tick, tick. I'm just trying to like figure out exactly where the, the hits. Oh, that sounds kind of arabic. God damn it.
Let's see how that sounds. That's okay, that can work. It's not super complicated or anything. And then we just need a crash. Big ass crash. Come on, let's get a crash. With a crash and crash and crash, 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 Perfect. Why didn't you just tell me so? Why is that the fourth impact? And why does that come after impact 22 and impact 39? Who the goddamn hell knows? We're not gonna question that too much. Or else, like we say, like I say, we might go insane. Going insane is not recommended by 9 out of 10 doctors, except for the ones in Canada. Maybe that makes some of these just kind of like... It's kind of just like straight up, just like, here's the chord. Also, I know that one sounds like a fucking harmonica, but it works way too well, so we're gonna keep it. Let's see, let's see. Again? Alrighty. Kill, die, the violence guy. Oh, hell yeah. Well, you know how to make music. How do I make this better? Or how should I continue the song? Should it just kind of like... I'm thinking a flute section. I mean, it already ha kind of has a flute section, but I love the flute so fucking much. Like, it already has a flute section. Maybe white noise. White noise always fixes everything. Unlike black noise, which robs... No, I should, I should really not make that joke. That's a really bad joke to make. Anyways. White noise. We do one oscillator like that. Turn the other two down. We do this, we extend that for a couple of bars, looks like a white noise patch to me. It just kind of adds background noise. It's just that way it's not so empty. My friend showed me that trick. So something here nobody will notice. Yeah. 
Yeah. I made that sound with my mouth four years ago. Yeah, I'm not even joking about that, and I wish I was. Needs more percussion. Percussion. I mean, this is already a banging song. I want to add even more percussion to it. Just like. I should add some like hi hats or just make absolutely crazy, just like drum fills and crap. I don't even know, man. I don't even know. But then again, like I say, don't think about it too much. Micro insane. My MIDI keyboard isn't attached to anything. Why isn't it attached to anything? I love this rider, by the way. I also use this in a rock song. I am not going to be playing that because that's an awful song. Anyways. Oh, we also we have effects. That's cool. I'm going to have to use those sometimes. I didn't even know that came with the kit. That's hella cool. Alright, we just do a sample again. Oh, we have impact samples right here. These are more like glorified snares, though. Let's see. Oh my god, literally, please just stop. I'm not saying that to like anybody in particular, I'm just like, why? There we go. Just have to, we're gonna make that a 148th note, because reasons. And we are not gonna make that a 148th note, we're gonna make that a 124th note. Works for me. We're just gonna repeat that after we add the rest of the things to it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This song is in four four, by the way. God damn it, photos. Anyways. See all the sound. Frickin' sick. Not too familiar with EDM. I've only made like one song. Oh, yeah, I remember that song. It was kind of went like. I don't have anything attached to the keyboard. Keyboard, attach. Where? There we go. Let's see, let's see, do a C major.
I this synth sounds great no matter what you play. That's my favorite part about it. There's a crap ton of crap on it. It looks uh, kind of sound like I can't find the chord I was doing. I don't know. Anyway, let's stop getting distracted. Let's actually make the song. Anyway, so I think it was just it's just kind of like impacts right here, and then it kind of just goes into like. It's kind of funny that I'm using this as a pluck, even though it's supposed to be a core song. I'm mean, probably thinking, what the f... That is kind of mean, what the fuck? Like, what kind of song uses chords like that? I'll show you the song. Where is it? Is it in this one? No, it is not. Is it in this one? No, it is not. I think it might be in uh, this one. This one, this one, this one, sunlight. That was made without OTT. That is what exactly what kind of chords you expect, and it sounds like complete dog crap because I don't know what the hell that was doing. What even is sound design, anyways? Kind of add like white noise, just you know, fill the air. I don't know, something like that, you know, just kind of like half time. Just go for it, I guess. Move it up here. I think this saw it was written in ab. Can't remember. You'll get abs if you work out though. A flat is a good key though. A flat. A. A flat. A flat. A flat. I don't know. What the <laughs> Well, it sounds kind of too like rap songy, doesn't it? It's supposed to be like a feel good house song.
Okay, okay. What if we just like kind of like have like the you know the white noise do like kind of a riser, then like it kind of just fades back down. Let's see, let's see. I think I can make that work. I can make anything work. I'm an engineer. No, I'm not. That's a lie. I lied. I didn't know why I'd ever lie to you guys. I mean, seriously, I'm never. I'm not a liar. What do you think? Oh my god. We have to move this up because otherwise we're not gonna be able to reach the control thing in my jig. Come on. Oh wait, no. You have to drag it with control. There we go. That's the only thing I drag things with. Control. Let's see. No, it's way, that is way too intense. Maybe we kind of make it like that. take like the lead from the beginning which goes like just put that on a different instrument and boom it sounds original again this is how music works buddy you don't make things that are original you just copy and paste the same things over and over again until someone likes it I kinda like this pluck sound I actually made this I forgot how I made it with like some tutorial I think I just like, I love this pluck so much, I'm gonna use it in everything. I need something kind of like flute, flute. I think that does it. All right, all right, we're finally moving forward with this stupid song. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. What should we add next? 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 I can't believe I'm saying this. I can't make that noise. I once I was able to make like the kind of like Dracula sound, you know what I'm talking about, where it's like. Idea, what if I add a modulator? Let's see, yeah, let's like, what can I add here that just like totally makes it go crazy? Let's see. I'm using my. My keyboard right now. Maybe I just like actually add a filter to it. Filter Ottawa. The oh, frick. Anyways. Yeah, you know what we're gonna do. We're gonna add that to an automation track, and then we're just gonna go freaking crazy with the dial. 
with a pitch bend dial. If I can attach it to that, that is. I don't actually know if I can. Because I've done this before with limited success. Let's see, synth. Okay, Ottawa. Isn't that like a city in Canada? Control, Alt, Delete. Yeah, how the heck do we just like attach this to turn recording on? What does recording do? Okay, I should probably do something first. I should probably clone this. Just make it its own thing. And obviously just like uh, have our own sort of deal with this. I'll just probably copy that. Paste that there. Copy that. Houston. Let's see. I don't know what get the what this is attached to, or if it's attached to anything at this point. Click here, record. Let's see. LMS automation track recording automation. Automation, automation, automation. You can automate option buttons? Why? Anyways. <coughs> control point. Okay, now the control point is. I can draw it. Select mode. Cool. Okay, control paste. Whatever, whatever. Are you kidding me? I forgot I added Bit Crush to this preset. Automation. This is Cubition. Hey guys, this is Cubition. This is a quick tutorial. That kind of banging track. What the fuck? It's better than I've made this entire time. What is he doing? Oh, he's turning it into an actual cute. Why doesn't he just turn it into a cute curve at the first? Doesn't look like he uses a MIDI keyboard. Come on, come on, come on. Is this what I'm looking for? While recording keyboard playing. Please? Please. Turn out the auto track in record mode. If you attach the bitch power wheel to a knob, well, the knob I want to attach it to is the freaking uh, what what the frick is it called? The 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 thing. You know what I'm talking about. Yes, exactly. There we go. This one. Let's see, connect to controller. Let's see, MIDI controller. Let's see, connect to controller. Oh, here we go, here we go. Woo! Look at me, I have the mod wheel. This is exactly what I'm looking for. Let's see. Set logarithmic. I forgot what that does. Edit connection. Wait, no, 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 wrong one. Channel one, no, channel one, controller two. There we go, now both of them are connected. Oh, come on, come on, come on, please let this work.
That worked! That is beautiful. Well, it's not that beautiful. That was beautiful. It's Oh my god! This is like having the power of Zeus in your hand. That is amazing. See, what? If, so if I can edit automation, can I also edit pitch? Can I also automate pitch, I mean? That'd be a set of a pitch if I could. Anyways, let's put this let's put this down here. Just for now. Also, let's probably edit this. Pitch. Modulation. Wait, no, this is modulation. This is random riser nonsense. That's that's literally what it is. Uh, okay. So I want to have like some really fancy ass pitch bends that I normally cannot get by existing normally. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Wait a second, wait a second. I'm doing the wrong instrument. I should really be doing this. Wait, no, no. Is this the right one? Okay, okay, this is the right one. This is the right one. Awesome. So, pitch. Come on, come on. Control. Click. Shh. Boom. Or a shakalaka boom in this case. Let's see. Let's first of all set this. First, I'll turn off recording for this. Turn recording off. Wait, I mean for the, the top one. Turn recording off. Also, is anyone watching? I hate automation LMS. Also, dinner was delivered and you were cleaning. Oh, so that's alright. I think I can uh, check out your music video a bit later. Yeah, automation and LMS sucks, but like I think I just got it to work better than most people have. Well, I mean, most people have probably figured this out, but like... To this extent, let's see, let's see, let's see. I can't see it moving. Hopefully, let's see if it... I don't think that worked. No, that did not work. That did not work at all. What am I doing wrong here? Let's see, let's see, let's see. So, let's see. Our instrument is not being controlled by our MIDI keyboard. That's the problem. So, any keyboard. And now our pitch is being controlled. And we have to detach it from this. Uh, we got MIDI. Wait, that's not the wrong way. Is this the right? Is this one? Yep, this is it. Okay. Hopefully, this will work now. That sounded kind of com like complete nonsense, which kind of sucks actually. <laughs> and also, that is not very smooth. I think I'm going to make sure that is smoother. And there we go. And then we're just going to re record that. That was really bad. <laughs> Look at all these automation points. Oh, I almost managed to make like an actual curve. 
maybe we screw that idea because there isn't a lot that uh, automation would really do for us, I think. Maybe, though, for this. Detach it from this. Input, master key, no. Attach automation to this. Okay, yep, uh, pitch bend is working. Pitch, son of a pitch. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's hope this actually works. That was complete nonsense. I think that might have worked actually. Oh wait. No it didn't. I forgot to attach the automation channel. That's complete nonsense. Anyways, it's around recording. Kinda worked. Not really though. <laughs> oh wait, we're recording right now, I forgot. Whatever, that wasn't very good anyways. Let's see. So to accomplish our goal today, we made some music, which is great. Yeah. I don't know what to do. <coughs> I think I might actually end the stream just about now because it's been pretty long. And we accomplished your goal today. We made some music. We actually made some original melodies. An incredibly awful hard bass song. And tried to continue this song, which was partially successful. So... I think that we are going to end the stream here, but I'll see you all in the next one, and goodbye.